Hi, guys, welcome back to my channel. Please share and subscribe my channel to get more interesting topic. Thanks. Hey guys, uh, welcome back to my channel. Today's topic is World Metal Calculation for Groove and Fillet Joint. This is the most important subjects for those who are working as a welding engineer or welding inspector and related to the welding field. This is simply we will discuss today for groove weld joint and the fillet weld joint. The plate length is 1000 mm and the material density 80 gram per centimeter cube. So if it is 5 mm fillet weld, so in 1000 mm how much weld volume will be calculated, how it will be calculated, we will uh, discuss today. So let's start from the half light. Now you can see here the plate length is 1000 mm and material density is 8 gram per centimeter cube. Now you can see the how we have to check that after welding finish you have to need the that particular joint what are the filler metal that volume calculation how you have to calculate this volume after that we have to check the weight this is very important for us you are working as a construction industry or any manufacturing industry definitely uh, so many people will ask you about this one then in that basis you can calculate or you can purchase the welding filler rod or uh, material so you can see here this is 1000 it is the uh, this is the plate length this is 60 degree angle 20 mm is the thickness of the plate now there is three section you see one section q one section p one section r so we need this q p and r section together volume after that we have to check the weight so first p p section it is very easy b into h this is b and this is h what is b b is the 3 mm and this is the 20 height is 20 so 3 into 20 mm square means 60 mm square uh, this is the b is 3 mm and h is 20 mm so this is 60 mm square is the area of p now we have to calculate q and r so how we have to calculate q and r let's check now this is very important q and r you have to calculate you know the this height 18 so how it is coming 18 this uh, 18 is the height so before you can see here this page it is mentioned the height is 20 mm so it's coming from here you see the this is the root face this root face is 2 mm so that's why 20 minus 2 it is coming the 18 mm the you know that this height 18 but you don't know this wide distance what is the length of y so you need to check first y what is y how to calculate the y calculate y is 1030 equal to y by 18 this is 1030 you know the very well the mathematics calculation 1030 equal to y by 18 so 1030 is one half 1030 is half into 18 so how it is coming y is coming is 9 mm so you got this y length and this height is 18 mm okay so now area this is one q and this is r so 2 into half into b into h this is area q plus r so 2 this is half into b into h this is the area into 2 means q1 another is r that's why into 2 into half into b into h half into b means this 9 and h means 18 means 2 into half into 9 into 18 so how it is coming how much it is coming total q plus r is equal to coming 162 mm square i think up to that you all understand this is very uh, easy calculation 1030 y by 18 y equal to half into 18 then 30 means half y equal to 9 mm so you got the y and you got the height 18 so 
this is area equal to you know the this triangular area is half into b into h so if it is one is q this is for one so you have to two into half into b into h so for r so q plus r this is equal to 160 mm square now you got the p you got the q you got the r area now what you have to do now total area q plus r plus p total 162 plus 60 222 mm square now you got the area now you have to check the volume how you have to calculate the volume total area into length of plate total area into length of plate total area 222 into 1000 means 2 lakh 22000 mm cube so the total volume total volume is 2 lakh 22000 mm cube so this is total volume so how we have to calculate now with metal weight volume into density volume how much 2 lakh 22000 mm cube into density is 8 gram per centimeter cube means 8 by 1000 so it is coming 1776 gram so this is the weight of the weight of the old metal this is the weight of the old metal so you understand this one so now we finish this plate length 1000 mm metal density for 8 gram centimeter cube for uh, groove joint groove joint now we understand the weight of old metal how it is coming from the beginning so you it is clearly understand now we will go the filler fillet joint you see the fillet joint same here this is the 5 mm length this is you have to only the area we need to know q this is the 20 this is the thickness of the plate and this is of the thickness of the plate so area of q equal to half into b into h so same is coming half b means 5 and h means is 5 so you see here 5 and this is also 5 so half 5 into 5 into 5 so 12.5 mm square equal to area of q so area of q equal to 12.5 mm square so now we go for same the volume volume equal to volume of q equal to length into area what is the length 1000 mm and the area is 12.5 so length into area equal to how much it is coming 12500 mm q so volume of q it is coming length of into area 12500 mm q so weight of the old metal now weight of the old metal how will how will be calculated volume into density volume is 12500 into density is 8 gram per centimeter cube so 8 by 1000 so it is coming uh, 100 gram so this is 100 gram means 0.1 kg so this 5 mm this 5 mm old metal deposit by leg length by leg length so it will be the weight of the old metal will become the 0 0.1 kg this is very important chart you need to know for this one and every construction and manufacturing industry this is very important to know required number of electrodes per kg means in one kg how many electrodes are required in which dia so if you go the 2.5 mm electrode 48 electrode is required for 1 kg if it is carbon steel electrode then it is 45 electrode is required same thing it is 3.15 the ss and cs the different uh, quantity is required for 1 kg now the second one is number of electrodes per kg of weld metal so 1 kg of weld metal how many electrodes are required as per the diameter if it is 2 mm diameter csq 132 electrode is required for 2 mm for 1 kg of weld metal so this is very important chart you need to know it will be helpful for your if you are working as a welding supervisor or as a construction engineer it is very very much helpful for them so i think all is understood from the beginning everything for groove joint and the affiliate joint the weld metal calculation thanks for watching the video 
don't forget to subscribe my channel like and share also and uh, if you subscribe it you can get the regular video there is updating i am daily or regular basis updating the video so many answer question and answer videos and on the explanation of the welding it is there so thanks for watching again take care